Welcome to The Shooting Show. This week, we're with Gerwin Jones, hitting the woodies in very testing conditions during crop protection duties, all arranged by the man himself, Mr Pigeon. Listen to that wind. So that's where they were dropping in a bit down in there as well. And we're going to be on the other end of this wood. So we're going to set up here on the end of this hedge. Um, the pigeons are probably going to come from all directions. We've got this strong wind behind us, very strong wind actually. I think it's 40 mile an hour today, um, 30 to 40 on times. They're going to come up this hedge, that's where I expect a lot of them to come from. I think a lot are going to come straight across the field out of the sun. Um, we've got to set up for the sun in our face, unfortunately, today, but it's just one of those things. And I've got a feeling they're going to come on this wood as well. Um, we've set it so as we can shoot nearly 360 degrees. Um, the, sh the hedge here now will give us a little bit of shade as well, so if they do come along the hedge, hopefully by the time they see us, we'll be able to shoot them. So yeah, uh, we'll see how it goes, but that's, that's, the, that's the general plan. Um, it's going to be really difficult for Stuart to, to film it today because they are going to be coming from all directions, I think. But if we can get them on film, it should be good fun. Left-handed of the hide, but normally I'd put extended arms on. It's just too windy today. They, just, they wouldn't cope with it. This thing would just go all shapes. Fake off. Just be gone. So hide's back there. Wind is blowing. God knows how much there. So what we're hoping is, sure he was watching them all yesterday. They were coming from those woods in the distance, heading to this wood here, then dropping in onto this cover plot. So we're hoping we can shoot some out behind us going down the wind and then as the day goes on they'll hopefully decoy into here so we chuck this back up the wind we put some dead birds out just down in front of us quite close because we want to get them as close as we can today because if you don't get them with the first shot with the second shot they'll be 60 70 yards away just like that so. So we're nearly set up now. Um, we're going to try a few steel cartridges today, the Ely Eco Wads, so it's blowing a hoolie. Um, <clears throat> so we're going to try them, 32 gram threes. We're going to use them through the Brown and Ultra XS again, which I used up in Brigands back in the season. Really, really nice gun, like it a lot. It's got the, <clears throat> it's got the half chokes in it. And what we're going to do, we're going to shoot some steel and some of the zeniths as well. Just have a play, just good fun. Just all the comparisons and just see the difference in the kills, if there is any. We haven't made a door today, it's just too windy, we've had to wrap layer upon layer. Just to keep the cameraman warm. Just to warm. keep the cameraman warm, he's, he's a bit of, he's an northern softy. He's 
down south in all the See hard ground. One's gone straight over the pattern there. Did it? Yeah. Awesome. Crow going just to the left of the whirly now. Good God, it's clean. I cleaned it. Get me out on. We're not going to blank anyway. We don't click number 13, we wait for another one. <laughs>
that bird flag. There he oh. goes. Oh, and again, on a mention. Ah. Get this one out. It's like, no matter what you shoot through this. We could double gun. There's a load coming. Yeah. Look at this lot over our heads, into the woods. Curling, curling. Come on, come Short on. Short tail over the woods. He's coming, he's coming. Oh, look at that one. Done. Over the head. So we've been going now a couple of hours, we're over here in Berkshire, um, seriously strong easterly winds today, um, we're out on the cover plots here on a, on a well-known shooting estate in Berkshire, um, like we said we're two hours into it and we've seen a lot of pigeons, a lot of pigeons, um, we're on 60 something right, 61, we've got a nice start, not everything's decoying but we've had flighting pigeons, high pigeons, um, one coming in now. Story of my life. Missed it. Anyway, um, it's been brilliant. The birds are coming from all directions. Um, some are coming into the decoys. Lots are coming over these trees. You see that one there now, look. He's going to come right over the top. Look at that. In this wind, they can hardly land. They're doing that. When you hit some of the high ones in the wind, it's chucking them 100 yards down the field. Um, it's just bonkers. Brilliant sport. I'm using the Zenith so far. Um, I've actually started using some 32 fours, which probably thinks mad, but some of these birds are good old range. It clatters them or misses them. But um, yeah, brilliant, absolutely brilliant sport, fair play. Um, we've had to take the one, we started with one whirly, the wind blew it down, we had to get one of the old ones and knock it in. It could only just go around. It hardly can hardly move. But um, yeah, hopefully it will continue. What we've got, there's the height, there's our pattern all out there. Puppy, heel! Dead. And no end of birds are coming up this side the hedge behind us, but they're drawing a long way down the wood. So just shoving this in here right close to the, to the height, it might work, it might not, it might send them further, but it might pull them in so we can shoot a few more out behind. We're getting plenty of shooting, but What's to say we're not going to get plenty more? See, look, he's coming up through there then. So we'll see. Look at that. So we'll see if That's them two. First one, missed the second one. Whoa. 
moving point. You steady? You go, coming at us. That hit it with the first, didn't it? Mm. Quite a taste. That's it, it's kind of a half a sport, I expect. Yeah, just gone half a sport. We've had a brilliant day, fantastic sport in this win. Um, every shot in the book today, just bonkers. Uh, birds coming from behind in front, in the decoying, flighting, doing all sorts. Just brilliant, brilliant fun. Thank you very, very much. I've had a lovely, lovely day, and really kind of you to ask me down. Pleasure, pleasure. I hope you enjoyed it. Yeah, a lot of fish on it. But no, I just like um, probably not many people know Shreddy, but um, if if there are guys out there, like Peter's very kindly has me down to the pigeons, he, he's had some some clients out as well today, and I mean he's bloody good at it. I mean really really good. Um, we've seen a hell of a lot of pigeons, and this this estate is only shot by Peter. Um, has quite a few other ones on, so yeah, if there's guys out there that probably want to experience pigeon shooting, um, I can't think of anybody better. With. Um, you just go through guns on pegs um, and look for Mr. Pigeon. This is the man. And um, yeah, brilliant, mate. Thank you very, very much. Absolutely Proper. Pleasure. Proper day, yeah. hard day. It was hard. Hard sporting. Hard, hard as in challenging sporting. Yeah. Big yeah. win. Good win. A lot Easily of side win. slip. Every shot in the book. Yeah, everything. Yeah. As good as the blue grouse is what I call uh, them. We call them the blue grouse. We still got to remember they're a pest and they need to be controlled and never ever ever get them mixed up with game birds but they are as challenging as a lot of our best game birds but they should um, we're always going to remember these are a pest that need you to not know any circumstance you could get them whether it's on a game plot like this whether it's on the crops whatever you've got to get them when you can like many businesses gun dealers have also been hit by having to close their stores during this confinement period so Browning and Winchester have decided to ask for your help in supporting them. Let your gun dealer know that you are interested in purchasing a Browning or Winchester gun from them and they will send you a gift pack in appreciation. All you need to do is follow the link in the description box below and fill in a simple form. As soon as the confinement is lifted, your chosen gun dealer will receive your promise to buy, together with your email address and telephone number so that they can get in touch with you. Well that's it for this week, thanks for watching. Please like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter and do ring that bell for more videos. And if you're not a member of Basque, it's time to join now. Basque, looking after your sport, looking after you. This has been The Shooting Show.